Hi, Joan Whitson here with the Early Learning Coalition of North Florida. What represents fall more than the apple? I grew up in Wisconsin and lived in Michigan for many years, and some of my greatest memories were trips to the apple orchard picking apples, and then we'd come home and we'd peel the apples and make applesauce, apple pie, and it was such a great memory. Now, today I wanna to show you a really fun craft you can do with kids using the apple. It's apple stamp painting. You simply take an apple and cut it in half like this and use the apple as your stamp. Then you're going to take paint and then have the, the kids get to brush it on the stamp and then you're gonna use it like that. Now here's some examples of what you can make. I made this beautiful fall colored tree by using red paint, yellow and orange and just stamped it all over. And then we make a trunk out of either brown construction paper or brown paint. Now, being that pumpkins are a lot of times the same shape as apples, a really fun project is to make a pumpkin out of your apples using orange paint. And Halloween's almost here, so why not add eyes? You could even have the kids draw in jack-o'-lantern faces. I added a trunk by either with using a brown marker or a pipe cleaner and then used a pipe cleaner for a squiggly leaf. Now this is my favorite project. This is making a bushel of apples using basket weaving. You take um, red and green paint and stamp your apples and then make a beautiful basket out of brown construction paper. I'm gonna show you a tip on how to do basket weaving. Basket weaving is really an important concept for kids because it teaches them the concept of under and over and it uses their right and left brain. To do basket weaving, cut eight pieces of construction paper equal lengths, like so. And then you glue one down like that. And then you take four other strips and glue them, just gluing them by at the ends so they're loose. Then the kids take the other pieces and they simply go under and over the other strips like so. And they glue them down until their basket is complete. And at the end, if you need to trim off any edges or round it, you can to make a perfect looking basket. Now, the best part of doing apple stamping is that at the end, you better save one because then you get to eat it. Enjoy.